Knock, knock, it's not. Oh. The blow thrower, independent flower, magical. This guy scared the shit out of me. Look at that. That is fierce. That is a fierce costume. I thought I was about to get mugged from Amazon. They just take the money in my account and auto deposit it. As a Sonic fan, Amazon's a little quirky. You can get some cool official merchandise, but you can also get some really weird off-branded is this stuff so that's what we're looking at today this is what the original baby sonic was going to look like before tyson has yeeted this out of this universe he looks like an anteater you've probably seen this one before too i think this is the one derek wore in the mega 64 sketch but i could be wrong Now this is the one thing on Amazon you should be buying. It's okay to wear this if you're in middle school, but if you're above middle school and you wear this, expect to be bullied. It just comes part of the price of wearing it. You're gonna get bullied. Sorry, I don't make the rules, but I do follow them and I will bully you. This is actually an awesome hat. <laughs> Oh my god. This is a cream beanie. I know it says great Eastern entertainment Sonic the Hedgehog chow beanie, but this is cream. I'm tempted to get this. There's only one left in stock. I'll get the last one. There's just so much knockoff, just clearly stolen stuff. Like, this is so ugly, but it is $6, but it has $5 shipping. I wonder which country it's coming from. China. <laughs> now, before you might think this is a bucket hat, this is a Sonic the Hedgehog Baklava's Mask Magic Headband Print Scarf 3D Headwear Men Woman. Fine item that will only run you $7.75 plus $4.50 shipping. A great deal. You know, just casually wearing this. Imagine getting robbed by somebody wearing this. Now, you might hate this design. Luckily, they have a selection of beautiful designs. You could walk around wearing this. This is so bad. This was stolen from an artist on Reddit because they were in my Rosotic Reddit video. Saddest part is the person that's doing this probably is making so much money. I'm not even gonna to try to pronounce that name. I will get canceled. It's almost happened like four times now. I'm not gonna let them succeed. <laughs> I love how serious this kid looks. Generally in kids' ads, they try to make the kids look like they're smiling, laughing. Not this guy. This guy does not fuck around. This is nightmare fuel. I hate this. <laughs> he looks more like a Grinch character than he does a Sonic character. Never mind. Go back. Go back. This is this one's worse. This one somehow is actually worse. At least this one has dead buggy eyes. Well, this one, the eyes are stuck looking in this direction. Why are they drawn like that? This is terrible. That smirk. This haunts me. Okay, to be fair, you can't look slick if you don't have a pair of Sonic the Hedgehog glasses it's fashion honey get with it okay low-key knuckles is looking kind of hot though like bruh this <laughs> this is everything i hate i hate this is terrifying <laughs> i hate that it's real fur too this is made just to anger us there's no possible way someone modeled this someone manufactured this looked at this and go yeah that looks right this doesn't look terrifying nope that's not horrifying at all. That's just great. Who is wearing this? Who is buying these? It has 41 reviews and three answer questions. Who is like, yeah, this is a great hat. I uh, love it. Very fashionable. My kids love it. They think I look so swag. And at least I got a lot of five stars and this will fit an adult head. And I think it will still work for a child. Okay. I'm not going to lie. This is kind of fresh. This, this is pretty fresh. Now, you've probably seen these. I think they sell them at Target. Bullring Sonic socks. <laughs> these are what you buy if you're a beta male. Now, if you want to get the alpha male Sonic socks, you've got to go with these babies. These are the alpha male Sonic socks. These are what real men wear. If you're wearing the other ones, stop drinking soy and get your dick hard with these alpha male Sonic socks from BioWorld. I'll be honest, they have prime shipping. They're $13, which is reasonable. And <laughs> look at them. I love this Sonic costume. He looks like he's about to skirt up. Like he looks like he just stole my girlfriend. See, this is the type of smile I like. Look at how happy this kid is. I I've never been this happy in my life. I love this sweater. I love the fact that they just made the letters off for no apparent reason. Wow, what a deal. Rise of Lyric for the Wii U for only $75.99. What a steal. Yes, the just funky Sonic plastic carnival cups of him winking at me. $20 plus six shipping. This is actually pretty cool. And if I order it now, January 8th, 
It might potentially get here in time for the Sonic movie, or it might be late. I wonder what country it's coming from. China. The logo looks like a meme. Why would they make every letter a different font? Do they not know how ugly that is? Sega, come on. How could you let this happen? Here, I decided to take this unfinished Elite Sonic fan meme of a sweater and made it a final meme. There you go. Compatible with Sonic the Hedgehog. These are literal full-size plushies photoshopped to look like they're next to small little figures. This is so poorly done. What is that? That looks revolting. Toys not included. Yeah, this is just a scam. Why would you spend $21.97 for this piece of shit plastic case? <laughs> what the fu- This is awesome. Like, legitimately, this is cool. Oh, here's the full set. Wow, that's so cool. I just love having a massive Sonic just staring over you. Hey, kid, go outside, you lazy fuck. Stop playing Fortnite. Seriously, stop playing Fortnite. Now, these are kind of cool figures. I think these are the ones they had earlier. These are actually decent for 13 bucks to get all of them with free one-day shipping. I mean, they're not great quality, but if I was a kid, I would have loved these. Although, look at Sonic's nose. How to be awesome. Bring the speed, bring the attitude, bring the cool, and bring your A-game. <laughs> Sonic, why don't you bring your S game? This is why your games are never that good. Mario would have said bring your X game. Sonic the Hedgehog, Sonic and Rings exclusive Loot Crate Adult Collectible by Loot Crate. This isn't like some Chinese knockoff. They just, they titled it that. The shadow figure they have though is so cool. If things look different from the last video, you're just going insane. Uh, nothing's changed. I'm exactly the same looking. Uh, nothing has changed at all. On this half, I'm going to be looking more into the toy side of Sonic Amazon. You might have seen this, the Sonic movie ramp that looks great. It looks so good that I guess they didn't get the memo that they updated the design. I guess no one really told them. A Sonic the Hedgehog official movie Mad Libs, which I'm considering getting because it's actually out now while the novel doesn't come out until the release date. Uh, it's, it's only $6.49, I think. Ah, uh, listen, at first glance, I like that they use the Sonic Riders glasses. Some love, some respect, I dig it, but I despise the name Blue Force One. It'd be cool if you could buy multiples of these and make some really long, like, Sonic level set. That would actually be pretty cool. The worst part of these are these are actually pretty cool figures, but they had to ruin them with this stupid fucking backpack hanger shit. Why can't they just sell them? Like, do they really have to have this gimmick? It's a fucking key ring. Stop making key rings and bag hangers. There are some great figures which would be good as figures but and you turn them into a fucking accessory. Okay, before we talk about Green Eggman, are, I need to mention Space Sonic. That's right. Space Sonic. Even though you've seen him in space like right here. No, this is Space Sonic. You know, you remember Sonic Boom when he went to space? Come on. I don't even want to say what were they thinking, because were they thinking? Ah! I hate these Funko Pops. I don't hate all Funko Pops, but they do not work for Sonic at all. These look terrifying. They're part of the void. They're trying to drag me in, and I don't want to go to the void. I'm pretty happy where I am. I don't need to be in the void. I'm good, dude. This is actually pretty cool. I don't know why they always throw in this, like, circle thing. No one ever really cares about these tokens. Why do they always include them? Spinnable disc? Who cares? Like, is anyone like, <gasps> A spinnable disc, yes! It feels like just cheap shit they're able to just cram in there for, like, no extra cost. Oh. No. No. He looks, looks more like a Jet Set Radio character than he does now. What the fuck? Now, this really interested me. IDW Games, I guess they have a game division, made a original board game and I, I bought it. Would that be good video? Comment, maybe film with actual camera, potentially, maybe good video, maybe. I don't know. That's your job, watch it. Hashtag game on. Ah! Did you need the hashtag? Was that necessary? Could you not sell this shirt without the hashtag? I'm certain if it said game on, it would have sold just as well if not better. This is very odd. I don't know how I feel about this. There's something just very cursed about this shirt. This is a cursed shirt. Like, I'm feeling demons taking over. This makes me sad. I, ah, uh, the way it stares at me, this,
Uh, uh. I love that they made a black and white figure and it has a single review and the one review it has is very cheaply made leg was broken when open i'm sorry for that man i'm sorry the leg was broken you know amazon you can like return it for free you can just say it was broken but still that doesn't discount your terrible experience with tomi i have seen fan fictions like this and the worst part is that i can order a paperback version oh no meet sonic the world's fastest blue hedgehog is speeding to the big screen on, in February 2020. On time to celebrate the film's release is this adorable storybook that introduces readers to Sonic the Hedgehog. Thank you. Now the reading community can finally get into Sonic. I like that it came out the day before Christmas. I wonder what target they were going for. Cute book for Sonic fans. So cute. Thank you, Gail Munger. Do they not know like dog tags are like a military thing? You know, I've played Sonic 06, you know. Watch all the influx of comments there. Like, there wasn't a better one than 06. It's the best game. Peak Sonic. Yes, another spacesuit Sonic. Along with just regular Metal Sonic. He's literally metal. Imagine if they put him in a spacesuit. That would be nonsensical. I'm so tempted to buy this coin bank because currently I'm using a mason jar just like this. And it'd be great once it's full to just obliterate it with a hammer and just have coins just go everywhere. That'd be epic. Holy shit. This is like the Five Nights at Freddy's crossover I never wanted. I hate this. I love the scene of like King Sonic commanding the public execution of Amy the Rascal. This is a very bizarre scene, isn't it? You know, you have to get the Sonic castle. Come on. I, I appreciate their honesty where it just says random Sonic figures and accessories. Because they're not acting like this is some famous iconic scene. They're just like, bro, I don't know. We made some money. Sonic Mario Pokemon Activity Book Jumbo 3-in-1 Activity and Coloring Book for boys, girls, toddlers, preschoolers, kids. Like, how is this illegal, Orlando Frenchie? How the fuck is this legal? I like how it's ages 3 to 6, 6 to 8, 8 to 12. Why don't you just say 3 to 12? I love, again, this is a different set of figures, but yet still, the nose. Why can they not just paint Sonic's nose? They could paint Amy all these intricate colors, but they just can't paint in Sonic's nose. Why? He has black eyes. You already have the black paint. You painted Amy's nose black. Well, just, just paint it black. Or at least for the product shot, you know? This, I, I can't even use words. This is a Sonic the Hedgehog watch with a fidget spinner attached to it with Sonic's head on all sides. This is the most purely autistic thing I've ever seen. I feel like if you wear this, this is like Ben 10's Omnitrix. Like, if you put this on, it gets stuck to you and you get autism for life. I mean, honestly, I'm down. It's a kid's watch. I wonder if it even fit my wrist, because I have a really fat wrist. Is it really sad that I would buy this? EXE Horror Games Roblox? Oh, it's included with my Prime membership. I definitely am craving to watch the scary roblox man yes if sonic funko pop wasn't bad enough they made a pez figure of it not of sonic but of sonic funko pop that's what everyone wants do, do they not sell like a regular sonic pez they sell all the mario characters why don't they just sell a sonic pez okay literally how do you not get sued for this this is literally just stolen one star, not appropriate for four to eight year old kids. We received a book that was a combination of two books by the publisher. This had only six Sonic pictures and the rest of the book was filled with filthy language only a seasoned sailor would use. It was an adult coloring book filled with profanity quotes. Luckily, I opened the front cover and saw this is a motivating seer book for adults. Luckily, Santa did not leave for my six year old. Very disappointed. I mean, what kind of fucking parent are you that you bought this? Especially when it lets you look inside. I like how it says copyrighted material on the front. I mean, it is just not your copyrighted material. Okay, this is $10. If the quality is good, which has pretty good reviews, this is actually pretty cool, to be honest. You get a bunch of Sonic stickers, some cool, some bad, some low quality. This one cuts off the words. This cream one's kind of cool, though. This character one's cool. Honestly, this isn't bad. Oh my god. 
It's a movie Sonic plush of the old design. You can tell by the shoes and it comes with 10 different sounds, seven phrases and three sound effects. Oh man, I really am curious what he says. Honestly, I like this figure. This is a really cool figure. But is it $133.91 good? I mean, it does come with free shipping, and, uh, but I don't know. I'm glad you can, with your Prime membership, they probably get money from it. You can just watch someone's Sonic Adventure DX gameplay. 2020, Sonic Show will upload our entire archive of library onto Amazon Prime. If I see any of you do that, though, I'm going to be really pissed. Oh, fantastic. You can get the entire space collection. You know, when they went to space. And that's about it. That's about all the Sonic stuff on Amazon that's at least worth showing you that's not just a logo on a t-shirt. Thought you might be interested in seeing all the weird shit on here. Honestly, this place is bizarre. I feel like I'm getting sucked into a vortex of cringe. Help me, I'm, I'm drifting away. I'm getting sucked into the vortex, help. Help me! Oh, by the way, also, you can't get it off Amazon, but go buy some merch at drinkupgamer.com. Fantastic clothing. A $20 t-shirt? Well, you're not going to find that on Amazon, are you? Are you? Drinkupgamer.com, the best merch for only a really good, good price, good price, good price. I still haven't figured out how to get the money yet, though. I haven't been getting paid for the merch. It's been selling well, but I'm not making money off of it. Help.